All right, all right. Welcome back to Fast Food Fitness. One of the things we love to do is review food and review restaurants and places to go to get out and get something good to eat. Good Company Cafe. Now, we got online, and since we're in the quarantine and all, they said, or the online said that it was open to dine inside, but we can't. Yeah. It's kind of funny. Check it out. They got a table in the door. You can't get in there. There's a table in there. And so, pick up orders. We're gonna have to eat it in the car or eat it somewhere, pick it up. All right, we'll get back with you with the Good Company Cafe and our review of what we're having. My beautiful wife went over there and we got a brought a menu back to the car. Let's check it out, yeah. All right, limited brunch all day. Snacks, sandwiches, breakfast, a little bit for kid. Ooh, this is a dirty menu right there, check it out. Anyways, I'm gonna figure out what I'm gonna get and I'll see you in a minute. I would like a glorified grilled cheese, please. There we are. Check it out. We're going to sit outside. Yes, this will be pretty good. Looking for something different. All right, so we're waiting for food at the Good Company Cafe. Thought I'd show you around this little, little spot here. There's really not nothing going on right at this minute. Sirene Studio, something going on in here. Walk through here, got all types of cool stuff. Kind of pretty. Here's the back side of it. There's the cafe in there. Nobody's allowed to go in there yet. Go in there one day. Little heaters, I guess, when it gets cold and heat it up outside, you can sit outside and be good. What else do we have around here? Something going on in there. Think left and think right and think low and think high. Oh, the things you can think up if you only try. Dr. Seuss, so it must be like a little daycare or something right there. Success marketing, all types of stuff. Some stairs going up that way to do something. Nice little shopping area. Kind of pretty. Get your hair done. I don't think I need to get my hair done, do I? Let's see what else we have. A little ABC beverages. But yeah, I might need to get in there. Maybe not. Anyway, some nice little area. A little radiant day, little day spa over there. Now we're, oh, Art, the Artnasium. That is the name of that place. So the rain's coming down. Here's the cafe, walking up to our little umbrella. Where we're gonna be sitting at the Good Company Cafe. Can't wait to try it out. Fast Food Fitness, just move. Go check out our garb we got for sale. Yes, just move. All right, so I will be your server for the day. Since we're in quarantine, Yes, I have a coffee for you, ma'am. And I have some water for you, sir. And two straws. One. And one more water for your husband. All righty, all righty. First thing we're going to try out here is from the Good Company Cafe is a latte with vanilla. Vanilla? Let's, let's take the top off, check it out. Ooh, very frothy, very foamy. That's right, let's give it a smell. Very sweet, smells good. Give it a little taste. It's a good latte, very sweet if you like it. Um, if you don't like it too sweet, I wouldn't get this. I'd get something different. So I it's like a good it latte. Sweet. You like it sweet, mama? I like it sweet. Oh, that's, that's a good latte then. Sausage balls. The scone. That might be mine, the special grilled cheese. Check that out. Whoa. Look closer in a second. Ooh, JT. Ooh, look at that. Look at that. I right, keep going. Wow. Avocado toast. Ooh, it's got a purple egg in there, JT. Yeah, it's a pickled egg that's purple. That's weird, isn't it? Beautiful. Let's start with these sausage balls. Ooh, wee. Well, that's hot. Yes. It smells like Christmas. Very good. Right out of the oven. Or it's been microwaved or something. Look at this grilled cheese. Pork all over. A grilled cheese pork sandwich. Look at that. Some type of green stuff. What is that green stuff you think? Ew. Some kind of sauce. I don't know. That looks really good. What do you think about that? Is that good? Uh-huh. Eat them up, buddy. Eat them up. Look at these little chips. Give me a little, come little chips. 
Are you good? What do you think, Mama? This. How do you eat that? <laughs> it's you beautiful. Have to tear the top off. I don't know how to eat it. <laughs> you want to tear it up with this beautiful? Here, let me do this. All right, here goes. First bite of the ultimate grilled cheese here. Good. It's good. Smoked pork sandwich. <clears throat> Not a lot of cheese, but it tastes good. That's worth it. Oh yeah, I'm gonna eat that up. Oh, you figured out your salad? Well, I got closer to it. What about yours, JT? Try that bacon right there. Let's tear these boxes open. Mm. Let's check this out. Egg, bacon, and cheese. Looks like a good sandwich. Get us a bite. Tell us what you think, buddy. It tastes a little bit like a creamy sandwich. All right, it tastes like a creamy sandwich. Very good. Eat that. Oh, you got a sausage ball I took from my hand. All right, we're going to sit here and enjoy our meal, and we'll see you in a minute. JT, do you like these crackers? No. They're a little bit spicy. Yeah, I like it, but a five-year-old would not. But I'll tell you something about this five-year-old. When he can wear his shirt backwards, yeah, you know he's living right. Doesn't have a care in the world. Oh, look at that piece of bacon. Is that good? Huh. Yeah, we love bacon. All right, she said there's a trash can right around the corner, and we can't bring him back through that door because of the quarantine and all that. Or the pandemic so we're going to clean up our own trash and take it around the corner and put it over there all right so we just got through eating and my wife has pulled out some more food from the good company cafe and it is a scone look at this scone was there a flavor for it cranberry orange cranberry orange scone look at that i want to try it let's all try it Tell the camera what you think. Good. I smell some cranberry. It smells sweet. Oh yeah. Uh-huh. It's good. Good. Definitely cranberry. It's good. How want some more? I wouldn't want to eat too much at one time though. Alright. So what about the rest of y'all's food? How was your salad? It wasn't a salad, it was avocado toast with a bunch of arugula at the top. So all the flavors were good. I'm, I could have gone with a little bit less arugula, but other than that, it was good. JT, how was your bacon, egg, and cheese sandwich? Good. I had some of your sandwich and it was good. The It was very good at it. And then I had the super duper grilled cheese sandwich. You'll notice that, that's not the real name of it. If you look at their menu, it had a whole bunch of pork on it and then some type of green sauce on it. It had, did not have a lot of like intense flavor. I thought it might have a little spiciness, but it didn't. And then a small amount of cheese. It was pretty good. I'd eat that one again. Then it had some chips that adults would like because they're spicy though. Your children may not like them. Anyways, so the Good Company Cafe. Check it out right there. They're open. If you're lucky, you'll get a spot under that umbrella. But that's the only place you can sit outside right now. Um, one of the cool things about it, and my wife found that, is this. At the Huntsville Botanical Gardens, where we spent the day yesterday, you can order a picnic um, that happens, was it three days a week? Is that right? I can't remember. I, I think it's three days a week. I'm not sure what days they are. I have to look it up. That you can get the food from here. They'll send it to the um, Huntsville Botanical Gardens. You can go out, you know, at sunset or whatever, and have a romantic time with a good meal out in the gardens of the Huntsville Botanical Gardens. It's I'll put a link there showing them um, the video we made there yesterday. If you haven't been there, it's a beautiful place. And lastly, what's a cool thing, right out around the corner of the Good Company Cafe, there's one of the best coffee places in Huntsville, Alabama. Angels Island Coffee drive through Yes, we are. You want to try it first? Mm 
pretty good. I mean, it's kind of a light taste. It's not heavy. One of the things I don't like about some of those, I call them frou-frou coffees. They are expensive. And a lot of times it's just too much. It's like they're too intense with the sugar. That's not, it's really good. Maybe I didn't stir it up enough. Let's see, let's stir it up, shake it up a little bit. Good, good coffee. So after you get your fine lunch, let me come over here and get you a coffee and call it a day. Then go cast a line in the water and try to catch a fish. What do you think, JT? Yeah, 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 Woo. yeah. Hope you like this stuff. If you like this, subscribe, like, comment, all that. See you later.